TV consciousness to so, incarnate into an animal form. The uh, tiny aspect. I just <sighs> made a phone call to the Patton Borough Police. 6.08 p.m. Uh, I was on the phone for about two minutes, spoke with Officer Dill, and informed him that um, that I would be stopping down to get my, my firearm that he took from me. Um, and he told me uh, over and over again, and I quote, you're not getting your fucking gun back, he said several times. Wouldn't listen to me, so I, I proceeded to explain to him why. Um, why I needed to get my my personal uh, pistol for self protection because uh, yesterday somebody came in my yard. I started my chainsaw up. I ran in the house to grab a pair of gloves. I go back out and it's on fire. Uh, so <laughs> call it a freak accident, whatever. Uh, somebody set my chainsaw on fire. Um, so then today I'm down in the basement working with my son. And I get a call from an unknown caller, and I answer it, and very, very nicely, they they, they said, oh, John, is this John? I said, yeah. And then they said, as clear as day, they said, your targeting will never end. And they hung up. And my son heard it as well. They said, now they're getting really, really bold. Um, and I don't, I mean, I'm not, I ain't scared. But I have a, a legitimate safety concern for my protection. <laughs> and it's my firearm. I would like it back. There are absolutely no charges filed at this time against me. I have the possession paperwork as well as the, the court documents that he... Uh, based the based the um, the arrest on that he when he arrested me in public made a huge public scene and took my firearm. Um, I have the court papers um, stating that those charges have been withdrawn. I, I repeat, those charges were withdrawn. They were not um, a plea bargain. It was not plead down. It was not a deal. They were withdrawn completely. So. Um, that's that's over and done with. I have no pending charges on me. I have no prior convictions of any drug charges or felonies. I'm a veteran. And I have a concealed carry permit for my weapon. I'm a single dad with two kids. And uh, obviously my life's been threatened. With, with, <laughs> with a pretty... Uh, pretty blatant in your face um show of show of force that you know hey uh, it's this easy we can target you and then they told me right to my face in front of my son which i never thought they'd do because he didn't believe me about all this shit but they i don't think they knew he was standing here they called me and said your targeting will never end and they hung up so i call and i report this i literally told officer dill that I, I am reporting to him that somebody set my chainsaw on fire in my backyard yesterday. And that somebody just called me from an anonymous number, told me that my targeting will never end. And his response to me was, you're not getting your fucking gun back. You'll never get your fucking gun back. And he hung up on me. Absolutely hung, hung up on me. <laughs> so, um... Uh, I need I need uh, some advice. I need your thoughts. Uh, comment. Let me know. Let me know what you think and and what my my next move should be here because uh, I'm just a little bit a little bit aggravated at the moment and therefore um, I can't see see 100 percent clearly what I need to do next. So I, I'd really appreciate everybody's insight. So let me know. Uh, stay real. Don't be fake. <laughs> like, share, subscribe. <laughs> Hit the notifications button if you want. I don't care. I'm not a big YouTuber. It just sounds funny and I have to say it, I guess, to be like everybody else. But uh, peace. Stay real. Catch you on the flip side.